Hey Survivor fans, please like, share, and subscribe. Check out my Survivor Puzzle app. The link is in the video's description. Is it Yinny? Yo ho, the witch Was it Yinny? Griffin! Is it Yinny? Who is Yinny? Was it Yinny? Yeah! Oh my god, oh, I saw his face in the corner. I saw his face in the corner for a second. Yeah, I see the nice team's face as well. He like oh, raised to quit our call. And yeah. Apparently, well. wasn't he like swearing or something? Yeah. Yeah, it was bad. Griffin. No way. We need a mini heart attack when yeah. I saw his face. Griffin, what happened? I called him out and I just told him straight up, I'm voting for you, but for some reason he didn't even vote for me, so. Would he vote for, would he vote for Eve? Me. Cause I'm he really a just doesn't like Eve. <laughs> Eve, you kind of, jeez, you put out all the moves today. Wow. It's only 11 Wait, are we merging? It's merge time. No, it oh, isn't. There's, we have um, to, surely. There's no way. All right, everybody. I uh, I teased it last time. Am I gonna tease it again? We'll see. Uh, Obviously, oh there are currently God. eleven of you left, and uh, we're gonna get right into dropping the buffs. Yes! 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 Oh, yes! Congratulations! Boys. Two tribes to three tribes. Now to one. You are now oh. Basic Basicus. Basicus, baby, let's go. You don't get yeah, to name what's our first. tribe color? What's our tribe color? Tribe color is blue. Oh, that's, blue. The only, that's the only one I don't oh, have. Oh, yo, Eve. Yes, sir. Oh, Eve was. I've got this. I have so much blue now. Congratulations, guys. I've got this Noti shirt. Oh, ew. Ha. You know what I'm wearing from now on? Congratulations, hey, congrats, everybody. You're on the merge, baby. Is that Griffin? <laughs> Victory bird. Let's go! And, uh, it's always you! Wait, is Eddie back in the game? What is this? And we also <laughs> welcome back one more twist. Oh. Eddie. No way! Now back. No way! No way! Eddie! 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 Wait, what happened? What? Eddie! My boy! Is Denshin Island? Oh. What happened? Uh, Eddie's I'm torch sure. was snuffed. Maybe. But he found his torch laying in a dumpster somewhere, found a lighter, and he reignited it. He is now. <laughs> Eddie, 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 we got done for you, buddy. We got done for you. We got just Don like that, you. tonight's meeting is. Eddie! Oh my Congratulations god. Congratulations once again. Enjoy your merch feast. Welcome back. You've Welcome all played back. Welcome back. Back. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, oh my god. god, Eddie's back. Uh, wait, how did you get back, dude? Eddie, you gotta, you gotta do Wait, a speech. Everyone be quiet. Let yeah, him yeah, talk. yeah. Let him, let him yeah, Eddie, uh, Eddie, give us your thoughts real quick. I've missed y'all. <laughs> How did, what, what entailed you getting back? Nothing really. I just got back. My was torch was just laying there. Yes, all of a sudden, I lit. Mm. He, uh, um, he magically yeah, found his way. Was. Somehow, yeah. through some Not, crazy luck. He got some dirt on the host, that's it. He got his... <laughs> <laughs> Blackmail. <laughs> Bro, how much money, James? There's no amount of money besides a thousand dollars in pillow pet tokens. <laughs> oh, no. I will okay. give you one Canadian quarter for 15 extra votes. <laughs> oh my god. There's no hey, bribing I'll give you, in this I'll game. Give you, I'll give you a full tune. Oh. Eddie, I cannot believe it. This episode has been nuts, dude. This has been insane. Wait, I gotta know, who's gone? Yeah. Oh, a lot of people. We, we got Donna well, before, 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 we, before, we, uh, before we start anything, before we uh, continue with any of the drama, you guys are all now merged. Marco is now telling his dad, who is more invested on this game than probably anyone else here. <laughs> uh, he's gonna have to be on next season for sure. Uh -oh. yeah. <laughs> My little system wants to go Congratulations to everybody for making the merge. All of you have played incredible games. Uh, one tribe now, one world, united. And I wish the best to all of you. And uh, yeah, good night. So much just happened. I mean, for one, we merged, and for two, Eddie came back, which has not been explained by production or by Eddie, despite me already asking them. So, I mean, I'm going to assume he blackmailed someone on the production team and that's why he's back, but something really big happened right after the Zoom call stopped filming. The Zoom call was still happening, but production was no longer filming. The big thing that happened is Michael decided he would tell everybody that just made Merge 
His big move to give the idol to Eve to blindside Andrew and Yinny. I don't know why he did this, but I don't think it's as terrible as it could be for me. I think it's a terrible move for Michael all around, but at least he left Marco and my name out of it. He didn't factor us in at, at all when explaining the move, which is great because it means I get none of the heat for this. And now Michael becomes a huge meat shield. I mean, I am a big threat going into this merge, but with Michael here now, after he just explained all of that, I may very well be able to hide behind him for as long as I need to keep him around or for as long as he doesn't get blindsided. I do need to readjust with my bro boy so because a lot of things have changed since I've gone. Uh, there are certain people I don't trust anymore because of certain things that I've seen happen while I was out of the game. And I've been told I'm in a good spot and I'd look to keep it that way. And I have been put into a majority alliance. And I'm just hoping that this can take me pretty far in the game. So, um, kind of my way of trying to keep under the radar was leaked and I actually leaked it myself um, I leaked it to the whole people on the merge tribe I leaked it to everyone basically I kind of just wanted to come off on a clean slate saying like I'm not gonna make any more power moves uh, and I hope I guess that they take the bait I mean I mean I think it was a stupid move I can't I couldn't keep my mouth shut um, I guess we'll see how it goes you know what, if you look at it like good or bad, I think the idol swap was genius in my opinion, on my part, because I got out Yinny, who was the person I wanted to get out from since day one, like realistically, I could tell he was going to be a good, good player, and we got him out before the merge, which was perfect, that's exactly what I wanted to do. So like, hey, you can't come at me now, because like I set out what I wanted to do. We all want to get caught up on the last couple votes, so like, the, the um, the Andrew blind side. I was like, what happened with that? And Michael's like, I can, I can tell you about that. I'm like, oh, okay, Michael, you tell me. He was like, yeah, I gave my idol that I found to Eve so she could play it on herself and then get out Andrew and then Yinny. <laughs> Are you stupid? Do you have to realize that some of his cl Andrew's closest allies are in the same Zoom call as you. Me, myself, Corey, Zach, Alex. And you think this is smart to sit, talk about this massive move you made? You're putting a map. Uh, you already have a massive target on your back, and you're making it even bigger. So Yenny got voted out, which I wasn't expecting. Michael gave Eve an idol, which I couldn't understand. I think we need numbers. We put going into the merge because the barrel had the numbers we were after losing Andrew and then Thomas, so it sort of sucked. But then James said, Drop your puffs, we've made the merge, yes! 
So going into the marriage, I think I'm in a good position. I have alliances with final three with Michael and Zach, final two with Marco, final three with Marco and Eve. Then there's an international alliance, which is Kyle, Marco, Michael, Eve, Griffith, and Zach. Now, so the only ones I don't have an alliance with is Declan and Griffith. Or not Griffith, Declan and Eddie. The merge happened and it's completely insane. People are scrambling for numbers. And my main alliance right now is obviously the BCG, which is Kyle, Marco, myself. And we have a larger alliance of six people called the International Alliance because we're from all around the globe and that's made up of the three BCG members and then also Griffin, Michael and Garrett. Now I'd like to touch on Eddie coming back because yes while I did vote him out as part of the fake carbon monoxide blind side I'm actually going to reach out to him because I want to be able to form a bond with him rather than just right away dismissing him and saying oh well he's not going to forget my game because he might be if i can work with eddie that would be a really really good move for my game because i would have an extra ally on the other side don't get voted out first it was my first goal did that happen to achieve that make merge achieve find an idol achieve so slowly, you know, check off these lists. Maybe the next one is to win. Maybe. So, in my alliance, there's a group of five. So it's me, Eddie. Oh yeah, Eddie came back in the game. So myself, Eddie, Zach, Corey, and, and Cody. So those guys. It's your boy, <laughs> Marco, back at you again. This time from the Merge Tribe. I mean, obviously I was going to make merch, I was probably, I'm probably the best player out here, to be honest. Um, I've been taking out all my nemesis, all my rivals, now I'm in the final 12. Not happy that Eddie's back, obviously, since I kind of eliminated him from the game, but who knows, maybe he doesn't know. Hopefully he doesn't, because if he does, I'm kind of, I might be screwed. But I'm in such a good position. There's eight for real people left, and only four people, we outnumber them by twice. So obviously I'd like one of them to be first out so there's absolutely no chance that they like work together and um, mount a comeback of sorts. But like all the Burrill tribe trust me. Most of like the all the people in the new group of tribe I was on trust me. I'm literally everyone wants to work with me. I think I need to use wield this newfound influence I've got where everyone wants to vote the same way as me. And tell everyone, hey, vote how I want. The one murky Wednesday afternoon looked into her email inbox and what did she find well i'll tell you what she found so an advantage was released i was so intent on finding this advantage i decided to look everywhere i looked all around my living room all in my bedroom everywhere i could find and so then i thought why not recheck my emails and then i saw the second one so i hopped onto youtube quickly Searching, never gonna give you up, absolute banger of a song. And then I went into the comments and filtered through to the most recent comments. And do you know what I found? I found the clue. Congrats, you got Rickrolled. And guess what? I got an advantage. Found it! So, congratulations, you have found the Jura Edition advantage in the game. This allows you to bring back a pre-jury boot back into the game as a jury member. This advantage needs to be played before our next meeting so this player can be available at the next tribal council and preferably as soon as possible so we can let them know. This challenge does not need to be used if you feel it is a disadvantage for your game. Well Sis thought long and hard and decided, you know what, it's between Alicio and Marwan and guess what, I brought back Alicio. Partially for drama, partially so people hopefully don't think it's me, and partially to annoy Yinny. Because Yinny should not have been rude to Griffin, period. Just because I haven't been going to travel recently, doesn't mean that these last few travels haven't been extremely tough on my game. 
Andrew, Yinny, and Thomas were all just taken out back to back to back. And that's extremely tough on my game because they were all numbers for me, and Andrew and Yinny in particular, I was extremely close to. Eddie came back into the game, and I haven't talked to this dude at all. So hopefully we have some mutual allies and we're able to work together, but I just don't know anything about this guy. And then, there's an advantage in the game. I don't know what it is, but I saw it, and I don't think anybody on Declan's side has it. So I've been trying to play both sides. I've been playing Michael's side with the International Alliance, and I've been playing Declan's side with the Barrel Boys. So we're gonna see where things end up, but Declan has an idol which he told me about earlier in the game, so maybe we can flip the game on its head. So it's a fresh slate. It's an individual game now, if it ever has been. And uh, let's get right into today's immunity challenge. So what I'm gonna do is gonna be, this is Survivor Class, we're gonna have a little bit of a memory game, all right? First color. All right, I'm gonna have you relay that back to me now. First one, everyone put up. What the? Uh, looks like everybody has the first color right. The first color was blue. All right. Everyone show me, next color. I missed one. I'm stupid. <laughs> Alright. I so didn't everybody see. could have gotten it wrong. Maybe Garrett was the only one to get it right. No. He was um, uh, yeah, he Michael, got it wrong. Garrett, Michael got it wrong. Oh, Michael also got it wrong. Sorry, Michael, I called you that. Alright. So, Garrett and Michael, you guys are both out. Everyone get ready, give me the next color. Everybody writing black. Everybody is correct. Right, next color, everybody put up. Make sure you're not putting it up early, uh, just so you don't give the other contestants an advantage. Maybe, do you want to like count us down? It's like Yeah, I'll count you guys down. Work. All right, so I'm gonna give yeah, I'm gonna Wait, give Deck. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna give Declan and Corey the point, um, as well as so everyone got it right. Uh, Wait, orange, orange, you, there, there is, there is no yellow, but oh, orange, orange looks the same. So it's, it's the same thing. So you guys are. It is orange. So if it looks yellow, just put orange. Are Corey and I good? No, you, you guys are good. Oh. Okay, next color. All right, three, two, one, show. Alright, black. Good job, guys. Yeah. So, next round. Here we go. So I'll give you a count in the first color. Everyone good? Three, two, one, show. All right, lots of greens, lots of greens. Cody, late, but we'll still we'll give him the benefit of the doubt. I mean, did you get it? Yeah, sure, all right. Three, two, one, show. Reds across the board. Good job. Next color. Three, two, one. Show. See, Griffin, you can just point at them instead of like hiding the rest of them. All right, yeah, that's good. Everyone got it right again. 
All right. Three, two, one, show. I feel like we, yeah, we're going to get a few here. Griffin, which one are you pointing at here? I can't really see. Red. Okay. So everyone either got it wrong, except for Alex. Alex, I'm sorry you're wrong. Sorry to get your hopes up. <laughs> Alex, you are out. Okay. Right. Next color. Three. Two, one, show. Corey's still going with uh, yellow. Is it, is it, the exact is it yellow or orange? It's it's orange. I changed. I changed. I changed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wrote yellow or yeah, you're good. You're 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 good. Three, two, one, show. Everybody getting it right once again. Guess a good memory. Before we taking his time, three, two, one, show. Griffin showing green, uh, and Griffin is wrong. Everybody else looking good. All right, last color here. Three, two, one, show. All right. Everybody is good. Everyone is safe for that round. All right. So, start of round number three, potentially the last round. All right. Go use careful with the the hands. Show your hands. Very good. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Alright, that's it. Let's see how well you guys can complete round number three. First color, put them up in three, two, one, show. Zach, sorry, but you are out. Three, two, one, show. Uh, Declan showing red, Eve not showing at all. So we have a red, we have a white, we have a blue, we have a white, and Marco, what color did you hit? You had blue? Alright. Well, Kyle and Cody, you guys are through. We'll show off. A we'll, uh, little showdown here. Everybody else, you're out. It's Cody and Kyle, it was white. That's the correct answer. Last. Thank you. Alright. Next color, three, two, one. Okay. Correct. Here we go. We'll get into the next color straight away. Three, two, one. All right. Correct. Okay. Three, two, one. Go for it. Black is correct. Survivor show. Three, two, one. Yep. Right, go straight into the next one. Go for it. Show. Can't see it, sorry. Oh, well, we have a winner, oh. we have a loser. And Cody. I had no idea and after that last block. Congratulations, oh. Cody. You have oh, baby. to oh, carry your memory. And Cody is the winner of our first individual immunity. Congratulations to him. Good job, Cody. Well done. Thanks, guys. Everybody else, you have a date with me tonight at Tribal Council. One of you will fall short, be the first member of our jury.
Winning immunity, uh, honestly, big, huge. Uh, especially since Kyle, uh, I, I, Kyle cannot win immunity because he is such, he's such a big threat. Especially, I mean, coming from Boril, just sur just surviving the merge in general. It's come to my attention that even though day one Kyle is different than merge Kyle, they're still almost the exact same. And you know, he's very smart, very quick to act. He's the leader. And he's been the Burrow Boys' you know, number one target since the beginning of the game, at least in my thought. But since I couldn't make it in that evoke, and you know, Marco had his carbon monoxide emergency, then he, if he won that immunity, he could have poised a huge threat to the vote tonight. But I'm glad I won it, and uh, we'll go from there. Since I got brought back, I've made sure all my bases were loaded on both sides, whether it be in my majority alliance or on the opposite side, and then comes Eve. I reached out to Eve knowing that she might have good connections on the opposite side, and we're actually getting along very well. And then comes the hard part. I look in my bag when I get back, and I have the trust advantage. And basically this means I have to will this to another contestant, and they can either choose to use this as safety for me at one tribal, or use my vote and cast it against me at one tribal. And as much as I would want to give this to Eve, I need to make sure that my majority alliance knows I'm with them. And so I will be willing my trust advantage to Cody, because I don't think he'll use it against me. And he's all about loyalty, so I know he'll never, it'll never cross his mind that he'll use this against me. My boy, Eddie! Dude, I, I could, I don't know if you could tell, but my reaction to him coming back is superlative. Uh, he gave me a little something something coming back called a trust advantage. What does this advantage do, you might ask? Well, he trusts me enough to give me this that I could give him immunity at the next tribal council or the, the tribal council that I use it as, or I could use a vote on him, an extra vote. So there's, do I still like Eddie? Or do I not like Eddie anymore? And I think I like Eddie. I really do. I'm glad he's back. Extra number for me and our group, which is fantastic. So him giving me that really strengthens my game. And I don't think I don't think I told anybody except for Zach and Declan. And so just that really strengthens my game. If they do try to blindside vote Eddie, I could possibly make a move on uh, the people that flipped on me. The reason. Alex is on the chop is because he's just quiet. You have to talk to everyone. You have to make sure that it's not you. That's what I plan to do. Talk to everyone. Even if to say, hello, how's your day going? Just, just talk. I'll keep you in the game. We're going to try and vote for Alex. Um, I don't think they would expect it. Uh, I think they're going to expect us to vote one of the big guys, like Declan or Cody, one of the more outgoing people. But we're gonna throw votes on Alex to kind of throw throw them off guard, I guess, in case an idol is playing like Declan or something or Kobe. I have a plan to save Alex. I don't know what it is exactly at this moment, but we're gonna figure something out. And our targets are between Kyle and Michael. I don't care which one goes home. We still got some things to figure out, but it's gonna be great. Hopefully, it works and doesn't backfire on me. I think there are alliances, of course, at the moment. Where's my alliance? It's gone. <laughs> so basically, the only person that I got left in this game is Zach. I trust him 100%. Uh, he trusts me the same way. I did nothing, nothing. And now I'm on the chopping block. Hopefully I can do something to change my fate or my destiny. No. Fate and Destiny are already written, right? So, my future. Well, welcome to uh, Tribal Council tonight. It's the uh, first one after the merge. And we already do have our first member of the jury. We can uh, welcome Elysio. 
Felicia is the first member of the jury. So everyone from what? the second meeting, what? everyone who got eliminated from the second meeting is back now because Eddie and Alicia are both here. We just wasn't uh, definitely wasn't planned, but Alicia How did find a way from the uh, non-existent edge of extinction. Not the completely. <laughs> I swear, I swear, there's something going on. And uh, he is now going to be at all of the tribal councils in the near future. You guys just made the merge. At the end of the merge, at the end of that last episode, <laughs> there was a big thing that happened. You guys didn't notice for a couple minutes, but Eddie made it back. Eddie's now here. He got voted out early on. He's made the merge. Cody, how do you feel about that right now? I mean, it, how I feel about it, it's kind of kind of personal to me, honestly, because, um, you know, I was pretty much the main reason why he didn't make it and why he got voted out in the first place, because... My personal life got in the way of the game, as well as, you know, Marco had to go. Um, so, you know, the Brill tribe kind of fell down after that, but we got Eddie back for Don uh, after, the, after the three tribes split. So I think, I think after that, um, after he came back, it, it was a big morale booster since we got him back. And, you know, and got to gotta keep playing. All right. You guys just came from three different tribes. Now you guys are on one. Uh was there really, you know, because everybody has social, social media going on right now, everybody has phones, laptops, computers, FaceTime going on right now. Marco, is there any, uh, like, was there really any time apart from all these players? Are you, are you guys really stuck through it all, like, after uh, tribe swaps? Or, well, like, was there any time that I wasn't talking? Yeah, I was, is, is because of the tribe swaps, was there really any distancing from any of these players? Or were you, like, you know, talking to everybody the whole time? Oh, I was... I like to think I, I've talked to everyone or, or just like hadn't reached out to people, you know what I mean? I've heard where everyone I've talked to have told me that there's a vote and I just want, like there's one person being voted for and I just want to keep everyone's nerves settled and I'm just saying I'm going to stick with that vote. I just want to use this opportunity to say like everyone's told me to vote one person and I'm, I'm going to vote that way, so. All right. Everyone's nerves. Alex. Yeah, you know, there's no secret. Like, <laughs> I know that I'm that person, you know, I mean, it's not cool. I actually think that these people are stupid because I'm actually someone that sucks at challenges. <laughs> so, <laughs> first of all, and second, like, I'm a number that actually people can use to their advantage. I don't even understand why these people don't want to work with me. Like, it actually feels kind of aggressive. No, one's, uh, no one wants to work with me. I've tried to reach people, like, I, and people just tell me, oh, I'm not gonna talk strategy with you. What well, kind of shit is that? Sorry for my language, but I'm just pissed off about this, but. See, everybody even now, looking down at their phones, everybody, you know, maybe people are texting, planning, maybe people are switching a vote, because that's how the virtual survivor goes. It can change just like that, and nobody can even notice. You turn your camera off, a vote can go from you to somebody else immediately. All right, so I think uh, I think with that, it's time to vote. I could ask you to go up one by one. Uh, Cody, you're first up. Okay, Corey, Alex, you're up. Griffin, you're up. And Eddie. All right. I'll go tell you the votes. Oh, dear. Votes. Retaliate. So, anybody has the hidden immunity idol and you want to play it, now would be the time to do so. Yeah. Um, I'm going to play this as my idol on uh, Alex. Okay. What? I can. I can oh my confirm. god! I can confirm <laughs> that this idol is a real idol. Yeah, baby! Let's go! Any votes cast for Alex will not count. What? Hold on. Read the votes. <laughs> now. 
Once the votes are read, the decision is final. The person voted out will be asked to leave the tribal camp area immediately. Well, it's as Michael just isn't here apparently. Okay, I read the votes. First vote, Alex does not count. Oh my god! Next vote, Alex will not count. No way! Oh. Alex does not count. No way! Alex does not count. <laughs> Let's go, baby! Come on! Yo, Alex yo, yo. does not count. That's five votes, Alex. All do not count. Next vote, Alex. Yes. <laughs> yes. Next vote, Kyle. That's one vote, Kyle. Uh, Kyle uh, again. That's two votes, Kyle. Michael. <laughs> That's one vote, Michael. Two votes, Kyle. Oh Mike. man. Michael oh. again. Two votes, Michael. Two votes, Kyle. Two votes left. Michael. That's three votes, Michael. Two votes, Kyle. One vote left. <laughs> one. And the ninth person voted out a virtual survivor. Season one. And the second member of our jury, first official member of our jury, it's going to be Michael. It's time for you to go. I cannot believe that, baby! Yo, good, good game. Move, guys. Michael, good game, brother. Good game, Mike. Yeah, You're a good competitor, dude. Well, Michael, Mike. if you have some uh, final words. Uh, I, I don't. Uh, well played, guys. That was good. Well, if this tribal is any indication of what's to come, idols being played for other people, and complete blindsides, I would say. We're definitely in for pretty good next tribal council and rest of the season. All right. Oh my gosh, you know what? I'm 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 disappointed in the way I ended up. I definitely could have, I definitely think I had more potential to go farther in this game. I feel like I'm a lot smarter than some of these people, but you can't win everything. And I mean, I've completed two of the three things I've wanted to do. Well, play Survivor was one, but in the actual Survivor was make the merge, make a good play at least, and win the game. And you know what? I completed two of them. Two out of three is a pass. So, I'm happy. I mean, I've set out what I want to do. I think I completed the goals I wanted to do. I'm happy. So, it is what it is. Hey, if there's any sort of returning season, make sure to vote Michael because I'll be back and I'll make sure to finish some unfinished business. They won the battle, but they won't win the war. I think it's time that we have a little chaos in this game. Oh my gosh. And the 10th person voted out a virtual survivor, the third member of our jury.